This video is sponsored by Pawtech.com. Be sure to charge your iPhone 5C with their signature dual USB car charger. Hey guys, it's Phil here, and today I'm going to show you a few ways of how to save battery life on your brand new iPhone 5C. So the first thing we're going to do is disable some lock screen notifications. Now we're not going to disable all of them, however if you have a specific app that happens to update a lot, for example Facebook, and you don't necessarily want to show it on your lock screen, we're going to disable that. So first thing, open up Notification Center. Then once you're in there, you're going to want to go ahead over to Facebook. And then right at the bottom, just disable Show on Lock Screen. Now what that's going to do, you're still going to get the alert. You're still going to hear the sound and everything. It's just not going to turn on your display when you get the notification. Next thing we're going to do is disable some location services. Now obviously this is going to be completely up to you because I know some people do enjoy having these on. However, if you go into your privacy under settings, then you can go over location services and turn them off or turn them off on specific applications. Now when they are off, if you're in somewhere like navigation or if you're using an app where you're updating a status, it is not going to show you the location of that update. If you want to re-update that for a specific weather application, then you can do so. Next thing we're going to do is disable background app refresh. Now something new in iOS 7 is all of your applications that are running in the background, what it does every once in a while, it will go ahead and refresh that application. Just get the newest data it can. So to do that, just go right into general, then scroll down to background app refresh. You can turn that off or you can just turn it off on specific applications and that will help out your battery life a good bit. Last thing we're going to do is jump into accessibilities and then you're going to scroll down until you see reduce motion. Now if you turn off reduce motion that will disable the parallax effect that will actually turn off a lot of the animation and save a lot of battery life in that case as well. So anyways guys those were just a few ways to save some battery life on the new iPhone 5C. If you have any questions leave them in the comments below and if you like this video and want to see more coverage of the iPhone 5C and 5S be sure to subscribe for more videos. Later.